Wonderful. Let's allow our feet to come together and knees open wide. Close your eyes for just a moment. See if you can feel that heat on the hips that maybe you created. Open your palms to the ceiling. Allow your shoulders to release. And as you inhale, let your knees come up just about a little inch or two. And as you exhale, allow your knees to go wide. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath. Exhale. Your next inhale, bring your knees together. Place your feet on the floor. Toes are wide. Take your shoulders and walk them down a little bit towards your ankles and turn your hands so that they can touch your feet or at least aim for that position. Now squeeze your belly, squeeze your bottom and inner thighs and lift into a bridge. Wonderful. Allow your palms to go flat onto the mat. But try not to press so much into the mat with your hands. Instead, squeeze your bottom and press your feet into the mat. Close your eyes. See if you can spread your toes on the mat and see if every single toe is touching down, equally distributed on the mat. Inhale, lift a little bit higher, opening those hips. Exhale, holding the pose. Inhale, one, two. Three, four, exhale, four. Three, two, one. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two. Release your bridge, beautiful. Push your belly button in, bring the feet into your body. Grabbing the pasta shins very carefully, rolling from side to side. When you're ready, place your feet back down on the mat. Open your toes. My eyes are still closed. I'm really listening to my body today. When I have my eyes closed, I can think about my feet pressing into the mat. I think about my arms driving down towards the ankles. Squeeze my belly, lift your bottom, keep your bottom tight and as it's up, up, up. Walk your feet a little bit closer together. Beautiful. On your inhale, open your knees to the side, keeping your feet together. Be mindful of your knees here. If this is too much for you, go back to where you were. And as you exhale, close your legs again. Inhale, one, two, knees open and open. Exhale, four, three, two, closing those legs. Inhale, one, two, three, Four, exhale, four, three, two, one. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two. Last time, inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two. Drop your hips, beautiful job. Hug it in. Maybe you rock your back from side to side. Wonderful job. Place your feet back on the floor. Place your arms back on the floor. Take your shoulders, drive them down just a little bit. Lift your bottom up and allow your arms to rest underneath your body. Now, if you need an assist here, you grab a block. Go up against the wall. I'm gonna straighten up my legs just a little bit. Now open your eyes, your eyes from your toes, but do your best not to turn your neck to look at me. Breathe. Need to readjust a little, go ahead. If the 
those toes up, 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 up. Breathe. Is that enough for you today? Or you want to join in with me and allow my legs to come over very, very carefully? Just one vertebrae at a time. Too much? Hold it halfway. Let your body feel what's right for you today. You could stay here or bend your knees, release them down by your head, close as you can to get your toes to the floor. Hands are making, creating a break on the mat and then very carefully roll down one vertebrae at a time. Wonderful job. Hug your shins and roll just a little bit side to side. Beautiful. Place your feet down on the mat. Now your option is to stay with the bridge or step two. Take your hands underneath your body. Exhale as you think about how you started your bridge. You start your bridge placing your feet flat on the mat, opening your toes, squeezing your bottom, and then lifting. This time use the upper body to lift you as well. I want you to kind of think about your hands right here. There should be a little air underneath your palms, making arches and domes with your fingers. And your feet are grounded to the mat. This feels good to you. Allow the head to release back and let go. Let's hold a few breaths here. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two, one. Inhale, one, two, three, head comes up, exhale down, three, two, one. Walk your hands back down, nice job. One more time in that shoulder stance if you like, otherwise you can hold a bridge. Take those hands underneath your body. First, walk your shoulders down. Think about how you started a bridge. You squeezed your bottom, squeeze your belly, lift it up toward the ceiling. Hands come underneath to support you. Toes up to the ceiling. I have a tendency to start bringing my feet towards my head right away because I'm so eager to get into the next pose. Instead, I really need to line up my body here. Hips, knees, toes, straight line. Breathe. We've got this. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four. Three, two, allow the feet to come overhead if you choose. Do not force them to go to the floor if you choose not to today. Bending your knees by the side of your head to release. Carefully, allowing your body to roll back into position and then take your feet onto the floor. Get back to that reverse tabletop or bridge. So push your belly button in, squeeze your body, palms down onto the mat, and lift high. Wonderful. Press down with your feet, lift those hips, pretend there's something tied around your hips, pulling you up, 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 up to the ceiling at the same time as allowing your head just to relax as if you're floating. Hips are pulling, pulled up, and the rest of your body just floating down. Loose and release. No pressure in your wrists here. No flat hands. Inhale, lift. Exhale, let the head go loose. Inhale, lift the hips. One, two, three. Four, exhale, allow the head down, 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 and let's inhale a little higher. Exhale, release, drop your bottom down. Wonderful. 
Take it to seated on your mat. You're doing a beautiful job today.